Hey folks, this is Ben, and this is Mario Speedruns, show number 85, and this is try number 2 on show number 85. I recorded a whole episode, found this cool Defender, and then the audio was bad, so hopefully that won't happen this time too. So yeah, look at that Defender, we threw away our Slay, uh, we still have our, our SU, Slay Undead, uh, but this Defender is way better, it gives us seat invisible, so it's better. All right, so let's play, but first, do a advertising. Ah, very great morning here. It is a potato masher. Mash, mash. Yeehaw. Here is the setup. Let's spin the wheel of source code. Let's spin it. Please be an easy one. Creatures. This is not an easy one. <laughs> this is the opposite. 126 lines long. This is the function that moves all of the monsters. That's what this is. Creature movement and attacking are done from here. <clears throat> By R.A.K. Robert. So, there's the whole thing. I can't go into this into detail, but you can see it's a big giant loop. See that? This is looping over all of the monsters in this level. Uh, seen or not seen? They're going to move. They're going to have a turn. Um, Mlist is our monster list. These are our instances of monsters. Um, and then you can see right off the top, if it somehow died, then we get rid of it. And we get rid of it in a weird way. <laughs> Look at that, because it was breathed on or eaten by another monster. Interesting. So, uh, let's see. This next big chunk is attack. <laughs> that makes me laugh anyway. See all this code? This is all about how monsters attack. <laughs> if they're not attacking, we just update them. Interesting, eh? And if we're at the done, if we're all done, uh, or at the bottom of the loop, I should say, we check again to see if we should kill a monster. So it's kind of double whammy. Put it at the start, put it at the end, make sure we, you know, make sure they're always dead. From monster attacks. Okay. Um, hmm. So this update mod, I don't think we need to do anything. They don't eat food or anything, so, uh, you know. They're not going to starve because of that. Update Mon might might move them. And attack is certainly going to attack. So how far away... This calculates how far away we are. Interesting. Movement rate. What's that about? Huh. If it doesn't move, then we just update them. So up, I think update is move. I bet you it is. All right, and this chunk here, this is the next big loop. So for each item in K, K is going to be like five, we, uh, we decrement K down. Movement rate. What is movement rate? I don't know. Huh. How many moves per this turn? That's, what it, that's the only thing it can be. So it could be, if it's moving fast, it'll move twice or attack twice. That's what it is, folks. Okay, this is the all-important loop here. Um, monsters trapped in rock must be given a turn also. Oh, so they dig out. Interesting. So if the monster is lit, and it's not too far away, I guess, then we do this, which is most of the rest. Huh. I'll just skim over the rest of it here. So this is the way they dig out or wake up or something. That's what this is. They're not attacking. They're just waking up. Apparently. Yeah. Or they're stunned. Stunned is when you uh, bash it and you see this. You see recovers and glares at you. So you can like use the, and you know how you see me bash doors sometimes? You can bash monsters, right? And then they become stunned. They just sit there like, uh. 
Anyway, makes me laugh. Balrog has a special case. Um, okay. But where's the attack? And the answer is right there. That's where all the real attacking happens. I know that. They'll cast spells in there. They'll move. Craziness. And then we're done. Um, the rest of this is about recall. Whenever you see our pointer, it's about recall. And you have to kind of remember that you saw things. So that's what this last little chunk here is. So uh, this is the main loop for moving creatures. It doesn't seem to do much. It seems to control uh, wakefulness. And, um, and that's about it. Whatever update mon is. Yeah, uh, it's uh, wakefulness and deletes them if they're dead. That's all this loop really does. And stunned. If they're incapacitated or sleepy. Yeah, that's that. We'll see where it's called from. Ah, uh, it must be in dungeon. Yeah, right there. I didn't, I didn't uh, see what uh, the parameter was, did you? It's always false. Must be true somewhere. They wouldn't wouldn't be an option. It's called no. It's called in a shocking number of places. And there's the true on new level flag. Attack. So it's just uh, whether we're attacking or not. So it just guards this whole thing. Huh. This doesn't do much without that, does it? Anyway, that is the creature's uh, function of creature.c. Wow, that's a good one. Let's play the game. It's early. It's really early, folks, I gotta say. Things look a bit different on the screen. This is our new display. We got rid of all the others. Don't need them. And this just displays whatever was on our uh, top line of our thing here. It displays this, plus some extra stuff. So yeah, it doesn't quite work right right now, but it's a step in the right direction. I hope it makes everything a little bit easier, a little bit better to watch. Okay. There you go. Isn't that amazing? That's just amazing. Two die four, eh? Wow. Wow. <laughs> Well, what do you say? Um, I haven't done anything here. <laughs> it sucks because you, did, you didn't get to see the Defender be found, and now you get to watch me go around all the stores. <laughs> it's like the worst. I mean, should we sell that SU? I know that this DF gives C invisible. I know it. The SU is a nice weapon, but I don't really see myself switching to it to kill something. So, we'll leave that as is, I guess. Minus one on that Iron Helm. Just a regular Iron Helm. So, what do we need here, folks? What do we need? We have three scrolls of Word of Recall. All the stats are up. The experience is down by 300. Hmm. I don't know. What do, uh, Staff of Light, we seem to have one. We have a scroll of recharging that goes with it. Very windy out there. Very windy. And the cat is here eating cat food. It's a stray cat. Wandered in because it's so windy. Anyway, um, hmm. Ah. Uh, Oh, the one thing I would add is a stinking cloud wand. The one thing I would add. And there's one. It takes everything we got, or at least half of what we got. If we need money, we can sell that SU. We don't, uh, we're not going to sell it. So. Yeah. Um, purchase. Stinking cloud. So you can see the display update there. I 
Sheesh, takes our money down, doesn't it? But we really need that. Let's go sell the SU. What should we ask for it? Any ideas? Five plus five plus six. Man, I gotta start at twenty nine hundred. Yeah. We'll see what he's selling it for. This helps the situation. He's going to sell it for like 6000 at least. What's he selling? 13 We could have asked 6000 <laughs> Oh, but hey, there's the money situation resolved. Um... Is there the, uh, if we have this much money, we might as well get a restore life levels. I don't see one there, though. Do we see restore life levels down here? No, sir. Hmm. How's our phase door scroll situation? We have 11 of them. We're good. We're good. Just check the... I don't know what that was. Oh, God. <laughs> Is that a new character? Oh, God. That's all he says. <laughs> How are you doing? We're good. Uh, anyway, I make myself laugh. Sorry for being late, folks. I'll have another one out on Sunday, too. I promise. A promise is a lot like a promise, but not really. <laughs> you might mishear it. Oh, he, he promised. I didn't promise. I promised. So, um, we're at 1,300 feet now. You got, you didn't, I'm sorry you didn't get to see the traveling going down to 1,250. But we're here now. We're looking for gain stats. We have found two intelligence potions. It's the only two we found. Um, yeah. So you know the drill here. Whoa, what's this guy all about? White Wraith. You can touch to lower experience. I don't want that. Let's, uh, get the phase door going here. Let's aim our stinking cloud at him. What the heck? Hit him a bunch of times with it. Um, yeah, we don't have our bow and arrow anymore. Well, that did it. He dropped a bastard sword and a small sword. We'll pick up the bastard sword. I gotta say, the defender is a good weapon, but the holy avenger is what we what we require. The Holy Avenger is number one, and uh, the Defender is number two in the game. So we found the second best weapon in the whole game. Now there's many var varieties of it. Two die four maces, eh, you know, it doesn't hit for a lot. But for us right now, that's awesome weapon. Another W. We don't have something that can really hit him. Don't want to lose the... You know what? So this is what happens when we run into a ghost or something or a banshee. It's not fun. Wand of Wonder, maybe? What do you think? Wand of Wonder? That got him. Drop some cash. Yeah, this is, works for me too. I can just look down here. But you can see it's not quite correct. Like it shouldn't have said that there. It should have just said that. So there's a bug. It's buggy. But you can kind of get it. You kind of get the sense of what is going on. What did he just do? It appears to be stuck. 
All right, let's use the old staff. Mushroom of blindness, we'll pass on that. You know what we're looking for? We're looking for uh, potions. No charges left. Scroll of recharging. On. Staff of light, this better work. Ugh. <laughs> we don't have light anymore, folks. Bright flash of light. I, I didn't, when I first played Mori, I didn't know what that meant. Bright flash of light. Oh, did it do something? <laughs> you know, like, did it work? I don't know. And you start looking around. It's like, I don't have that <laughs> item anymore. It's gone. Well, that's bad. So maybe we'll be heading back to the town a little sooner than expected. We were doing so well. Looks like a special room. We can't turn on the lights, but we can start searching. If this isn't a special room, I'll eat my hat. Isn't it? I might have to eat my hat. Not a special room. Huh. How about them apples? <clears throat> Every now and then the, the old map dungeon generator can confuse me. I bet you that's another white wraith. Any scrolls of light? I should have bought scrolls of light. What is it that's casting spells? There it is. Grey Wraith. Nothing is known. I don't want to lose a bunch of experience. Let's teleport away. Teleport him away. Okay, it's still here. Ay, what am I going to do with him? I'm going to phase door. Aim our stinking, our wand of wonder, I guess. Make sure he's right in here. I didn't hit him. See down here it says aiming wand of wonder. So it doesn't appear up here. But it does appear in that. Just to give you a sense of what did he do? What, what, what was Ben up to there? Wand of Wonder. Cold Ball. Well, that had to do it. Nope, didn't do it. Well, let's just hit him at this point. But we have a shovel, so let's not do that. Uh, uh, read phase door. He got us. Switch to that. Close the door. There he is. Oh, he's fast. Screw him. Look at that. He's really taking down our hit points. That got him. Huh. 3,000. Hard studded leather is no good. Yeah, I think we're going to have to go back up to the town soon. We really need a ranged weapon. Oh, that defender's awesome, though. And we need light, of course. Yeah, we don't really want to be searching around in the dark here. Running into God knows what. Like that. No charges left. Hmm. Let's 
Son of a... Yeah, it's like this is our life now. Oh, wrong scroll, Ben. Yeah, what can you do? Like, uh, we're, we are hosed here, right? Still there. And it dropped a potion. Uh, and a flail. Potion of ugliness. We don't need one of those, do we? Yeah. You know what? I'll try to keep it going here until uh, we run out of time. And I'll go back up to the town on extra time so you don't have to watch it. Um, I'm at 1,300 feet because I fell through a trap door, which is the only reason why I'm at 1,300 feet. I should probably find stairs going up. Up and away. Just so if I fall down another trap door, I'm safe. Well, no wraiths. That's a good thing. There's the stairs. We should take those stairs. Check this room first. What was that? You feel better. He's not on anything, is he? No. Okay, stairs. 1250. 1250 is where our best chance is of finding potions. Mr. Naga. Hopefully there will be fewer wraiths here. There's a trade-off, right? Oh, what is it? Morning Star. Is it fancy? It could be. We're blinded, folks. We slayed it, but we're hurting. Mm-mm. It touches you. Another wand of teleport away. We'll drop our current one. And we'll drop our wand of wonder. Maybe keep that stinking cloud wand. Ooh, his chest. What is in the chest? Money and a scroll of enchant armor. Use it. And it worked. Huh. We have metal scale now, by the way. That's another thing that changed. I went back to metal scale. It was better than the chain. But we're looking for potions. Or rings but not a feather falling. I want to change this uh, looking thing to say what we looked at. You're getting hungry. Lot of money. Okay, we're out of time, folks. I'm gonna head back up to the town. Yep, 
if I have any uh, any scrolls of word of recall after that. All right. No potions here either. <clears throat> All right, folks. So yeah, what do you think of this thing down here? Is it working? Is it better? Let me know if you like it. There is a, a split dichotomy here, to use a fancy word. This display is really based on this. And this is not telling me what I did, really. It's always telling me the response to what I did. It's kind of a... I think I've talked about this before. It's like it's a neat... Uh, if you if you want to make a good game, you don't tell people what they just did. You know, I know that. Open door. You open the door. Oh, you open the door means, yes, it worked. Like, uh, you know, you don't say you are trying to open the door. Does that make sense? Anyway, this display down here is a little bit different. I want you to see what I'm doing. So that's when you kind of want the, uh, yes, I'm using the wand now kind of thing. So there's a bit of a split idea there. Uh, do you think it should scroll up or scroll down or I don't know. These days in Twitter, I think, don't things kind of scroll up newest at the top? I think scrolling like newest at the bottom makes more sense, but that's just me. Okay, so I'm going to head up into town and then I'll be back for some extra time. Well, I'll be back if I can identify that stuff. Flail, Bastard Sword, and Morningstar. I'll be right back. Alright folks, we're back. There's no life levels potion and there's no light to be had. So, that's bad. But anyway, we'll identify the stuff. Maybe it's good. Bastard Sword. Another SU. Look at that. Isn't that strange how we just sold one and then it gives one back? For the longest time, I thought that was a thing in the game where the code would actually do that. Like it would go into a pool where it recycles them back, recycles them back maybe. Look at that. It's, about the, it's better than the one we had. Much better. All right. Another identify scroll. I'm curious about the one we found under the rock. I think that was the flail or the morning star. Very good flail. And 12 identify on the morning star. This is what I have high hopes for. Damned. Hmm. That's what I get. That's what I get for having high hopes, huh? <laughs> All right. So we have four scrolls of light, but that's it. That's like nothing. Okay, I'm going to sell the stuff and head back down. And uh, if, if I get back, it, it'll be an interesting situation where we, or we found a potion. All right, I'll be back. Okay, folks, we found a potion. It's a purple potion. We don't have any more scrolls of identify. I used it up. And uh, so I don't know what this purple potion does, but we'll hang on to it and check it later. Well, there's a quill thug hanging around here somewhere. Oh, we're poisoned. He just teleported away on me. What's that? What is he? Nasty little gnome. Confuse him. And hit him. And he dropped a potion. Another purple potion. If those are good, we'll be happy for that. <laughs> but it's probably bad. Back to quill thug hunting. He's around here somewhere. Is he in this room? There he is. Hit him with our lightning bolt. Bought it at the store. All right. Purple mushroom patch, stay away from those. Two purple potions. Not bad. I'll keep looking. It's another potion. Azure. How do you, how do you say that? Azure? Azure, or do you say with the U, like Azure? I don't know. I have one. Is it good or bad? We don't know yet. Find out later. Special room here with something in it. 
What is it? What's in there? Where's the door at? Right here? No? Is it over here? There's the door. A golem. An invisible stalker. These golems take a lot of hits. Let's count them. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Uh oh. Okay, his doorway here. That invisible stalker can do damage too. What is the weapon? A cutlass. Not really worth anything. Oh. Huh. That was uh, 23 in total. There, we got him too. But boy, oh boy, is our experience hurting. We're down to level 25. Dagnabbit. I'll keep looking. Another potion. I hope these are good, useful potions. It's a red one this time. Pack is getting filled up with them. Keep searching. All right, folks, it's a blue speckled potion. And from here, I think I'll just head back up to the town and see what all these potions are. They're probably not very good. But maybe they're good. Like, they'll probably lose strength and lose whatever. Or some of them might not even be stat related. But there is, like, the very small chance that we could have a potion of invulnerability. And we're losing our life again. Ugh. Lose intelligence. See what I mean? Ugh. Yeah, I can't carry that wand. Not hurting for money? We'll leave it alone. I'll be back when I get to the town. Alright folks, I have two scrolls of Identify, only two. So I'll we'll have to uh, sell the others to see what they are and buy them back. So, um, let's try the purple potions. We have two of those. If those are good, it'd be great. Let's see what they are. Dexterity, that's awesome. Wow, that's one of the stats we need upped for sure. Didn't mean to take on the Balrog. We need, we like all of our stats up, but really strength, dexterity, and constitution. Yeah, let's quaff those now. Can't believe that. Very nice. Let's try the Azure potion. Azure? I don't know. <laughs> ben can't speak. Uh, e. Wisdom. Wow. Not one we need. Wow. I can't believe they're both good potions. And we'll try to sell that blue speckled right here. What are you? What are you? Charisma. Huh, we picked the right one. Made 10 gold pieces on that. We don't... Charisma isn't used... It's just used for prices, I think. So I guess we'll leave it there. And, uh, yeah, we'll check out the charts and uh, see how... Oh, there's one more thing. Restore life levels. We need it badly. Where are you? Let's buy those. Uh, buy all those. Uh, we don't have restore life levels. Our strength is down. Um, yeah, we really need one of those. Restore life levels, you see it anywhere? I don't. Son of a crapper. Okay, let's check out the charts. I gotta do this though. All right, let's uh, see the charts. Here he is, Mr. Kyrian. I wonder what our score is with the Defender. Dungeon depth will be going up to 1300. Ba-boom. Up and down, up and down at 1300. 
really leveled off on experience thanks to those wraiths. Look at that, yeah. That's a shame. And we're not even much trouble, but these experience points, we need those, right? If we don't get experience, we don't get hit points. If we don't get hit points, we can't take on the Balrog. Armor class, brrrr. Craziness going on there. Gold piece is highest ever. And you can see our score, we topped out at 50,000, folks. How about them apples? All right, uh, Wisdom went up one, Dexterity went up two. And we're on our way. We're on our way to collecting these gain stat potions. I hope it's not uh, too boring because this is what we're going to do for the next 20 episodes. <laughs> Hopefully an extra time. So uh, we've been playing for 16 days in the dungeon and 15 and a half hours of total playtime. Huh. Are we halfway there to getting to the Balrog? Maybe. Maybe. Could be like a total of 30 hours of gameplay, maybe? Depends. It just depends on when you find the speed item. 1300 is our lowest depth. 22,000 experience points is our most, is our highest. It's not what we're at now. Uh, 26 is our highest level. Again, not where we're at now. And we'll be catching up to Noggle in a while. No dragons yet. We haven't even seen a dragon. Uh, 337 is our highest hit points. AC is on the rise, 43. Yeah, halfway there to Noggle on that one. And, oh, we're uh, number three on all-time gold. That's a step up. And the all-important score, we're at 47,000 points. How do I get back? Take me home. Go the slow way. Yeah, score isn't important. I say it is, but it's not. <laughs> so, what do we need? Where do we go? Um, more of the same. Need light. Need restore life levels. Need phase door. Right? <clears throat> right? I did buy a crossbow. So, uh, we'll... You know, we'll use that. We'll phase door away, switch to crossbow, and... <laughs> that's the idea. I currently have iron shots, which don't work as well as bolts. You're supposed to use the... I think. I think that's how it works. They don't work as well. you got to use arrows for bows and bolts for bow, uh, bolts for crossbows. So, um, yeah, uh, the, the medium strategy is find, find strength potions, dexterity potions, and, and constitution potions. And meanwhile, not let our experience dwindle. Longer range, we need the Ring of Speed or Boots of Speed. At least one. And that's the next big gate. And we also need, of course, the Holy Avenger. So those three things. Ha! <sighs> yeah. And uh, also, we need the, uh, what do you call it? The Potions of Invulnerability. We need about five or six of those. So that's our view to the end, all the way to the Balrog. That's how far away we are. What do we have of what we really need? Just a few potions. <laughs> Two dexterity potions. And, and the item that gives us the invisible. That's where we are in the grand scheme of things. Yeah, we're at the start. Really. But once you start killing dragons, like the stuff just piles up. So we'll leave it there. Yeah, sorry for missing a few days here. But I will be back on Sunday. And we'll do this all again. Alright, see you later. Bye-bye.